Hi guys, you're welcome to the Laura Studios. This is another episode of Android programming. We'll be talking about how to integrate emotions using emoji con as the emoji icon library in Android. Uh, in this particular tutorial, uh, we're going to learn how to actually integrate the emotions using the, uh, the emoji con library uh, in Android application through uh, the source file I'll be explaining to you uh, in details. Uh, emotions are a combination of keyboard characters and symbols which represent a facial expression such as smile or frown. So in this particular session, uh, we're going to learn how to actually integrate those stuff into our Android application uh, using the emoji con library in Android application. I'll be moving straight to Android Studio uh, where I have my source files. Uh, we in my Gradle scripts, uh, the build Gradle projects and models app session in the module app session we need to include one particular dependency that is very very important become the rocker hieu emoji con library 1.3.3 all right you can have uh, the air version but you actually need to include this particular library the emoji can uh library uh once you include this synchronize with uh uh you you have to synchronize gradle and it's going to actually compile this together i'll be going straight to the rest uh the layout the activity main which is the uh ui xml of this application now the relative layout as the parent tag and we have the xml ns calling the emoji or the emoji icon the way anyhow you feel uh it's appropriate for you to pronounce it or suitable for you to pronounce it you can say emoji icon or you can say emoji icon. okay uh in the layout suite we have the match parent the right match parent the padding bottom left right top all 16 dps are uh, calling the context the the main activity of this particular application now we have the tag from the library com.rocker hiu emoji can uh the calling the emoji uh can text view now we're going to assign a text called text emoji can uh the alignment is baseline and the layout with match parent and the height wrap content the same thing goes for the edit text you actually have to call it edit text it's particularly edit text from the same library emoji can uh the frame layout uh we have the frame for all the icons where the uh where the uh smileys will actually sit uh where we assign an id to it called emoji counts now i'll be moving straight to the main activity of this application we have the main activity extends the app compact it implements the emoji con grid fragment fragment on emoji con click listener now on that listener uh we have for its fragments and we have for its backspace click listener these are the necessary listeners you need to integrate or you need to implement in your application now it's calling the library the emoji can edit uh, text the grid frame le fragment the text view uh and also its fragments now we set the fields uh based on the edit text of the emoji can we have uh, the m edit emoji can and the m text emoji can uh our on create method we're going to set the content view to the layout activity main and we initialize the emoji edit text and the emoji uh, text view no we have to initialize it by calling it appropriate id and in the emoji icon uh we add the text change listener you no know? now uh we have uh, the before text change where we have the character sequence uh the start as an integer the count and after you know, the start uh you can't see it and it's after they have the after text changed you no know? and we have the on text change you know right inside these methods uh these are empty methods anyway uh this notify that within the count characters beginning at start uh you have just replaced the old text that had length now the m text emoji icon we're going to set the text the same thing goes for the uh fragment you have to instantiate to false now the set emoji icon fragment uh, you get the support fragment manager you begin transaction and you replace based on its id emoji icon or emoji cons uh fragment and set the instance 
Now you commit. On image icon click. You're going to have the image icon as the object uh, being passed. Uh, so on input, the edit text is actually going to call on uh, the uh, is going to actually call on the uh, smileys, you know, which is actually going to show uh, gracefully to you. Now let's look at the manifest. Any uh, funky thing there? No, we only have the launcher activity, which is just the main activity of this application. I'll be showing you this in an Android emulator, and I will also be uploading the source file to my GitHub account so you can use integrate the emoji icons uh, into your Android application. Whereby you would, you might have been seeing applications like uh, WhatsApp or uh, uh, Facebook mobile application, uh, Facebook Messenger, right in Android application using the emoji icon library. Now let's get to look at this on the Android emulator. Now we have this. So you have the uh, smileys, right, uh, showing it to you in different uh, segments. Or smileys you click on this shows out animals this is for the kings let's crown we also have for cars and uh, we have for shapes so these are structures and shapes now for the smileys you no know, it's more than smileys anyway we have for all that stuff now for the smiley for you to easily pick uh, any one of these just click on any of the smiley it's going to show up there and you can easily cancel all right and you notice that and you can easily delete them right there so you can even improve more on this probably this is going to show only when you click on the edit text you know just you trigger the uh display once the edit text is being clicked so this is just quite simple you can just integrate that so you can add more live to your edit text you know you can integrate the emoji icons so that you can have a uh, ui looking great uh looking robust like uh the whatsapp and the facebook applications out there thank you very much for nagging out with me throughout this session and don't forget to subscribe to my channel have a wonderful time bye bye